A warm welcome to Wolfson College and congratulations on making it to Oxford University. As you'll be discovering, Wolfson does have a special character. First, we are a graduate only college, a home to those studying their masters and doctorates. And that gives us a more mature atmosphere, one where we are collectively probably more responsible, where families are often at the heart of the college and where term time is a slightly looser concept. And it also means that we're very international. Three quarters of us are not British. Second, we have had a strong egalitarian ethos since our establishment in the mid 60s. And as our architecture bears witness, we're modern, open, against hierarchy and against outdated tradition. Students are at the heart of committee work and the twice termly general meeting chaired by a student is the parliament of the college. And that special character means that we've probably experienced COVID differently from many other colleges. We stayed open throughout, providing a community to over 200 people in college, even in the deepest of lockdown. We locked down earlier than others and have opened up over the summer. I want to keep the college open and fully functioning throughout this Michaelmas term too, something which is so important to all of you. We've done so much through the summer to prepare for this day. But to keep it fully functioning means no outbreaks. The number of cases in Oxford City means we cannot be complacent. And here at Wolfson, we're ready to deal with individual cases through self-isolation. But once a single case turns into multiple cases and we're faced with a full outbreak, there will be no alternative but to go back to lockdown. And nobody wants that. So how do we prevent outbreaks? It's simple and in our own clean hands. Hygiene, face coverings, two meter social distancing are at the heart of it. Messages I know you've heard many times but they remain as true today as when you first came across them. The single most important concept for you this term will be your household. Often a group of between six and eight people you share your home space with, they will also be your COVID contacts. If one of you has to self-isolate, all of you will have to self-isolate. And the larger the number of your COVID contacts, the more often you'll have to self-isolate and the less you'll be able to engage in college and university life. When you're outside your household, you should be two meters apart and wear a face covering indoors in most situations. The university has set up our own testing regime with test centers in the Radcliffe Infirmary Quarter and up at the Old Road campus. So you may want to check up which is the easiest for you to reach in case of an emergency. Now, I know that following these new routines will be a frustrating discipline. You will want to get more close to more people, but if you do, the risk of transmission rises, the risk of an outbreak rises, and the risk of lockdown again rises. So please be responsible and think of those in this community who are at heightened risk, those with underlying conditions or greater vulnerability. Please think of your community as much as you think of yourself. It will be a strange term. We'll all have to behave in ways which are out of character and perhaps feel unnatural, but that's the only way we can stay safe and stay healthy at Wolfson. There's a full and active term ahead. We had no COVID cases in college through lockdown and over the summer, so please keep it that way. Protect your community, the vulnerable and yourself. Above all, please enjoy life at Wilson and at Oxford. You've worked very hard to get here and you deserve to make the very most of it.